In the markets of Madras, in Tamil Nadu, a hybrid fish known as golden fish is a popular food item. And to prove a point, these fish are sold alive. They are healthy, though they were bred by a distillery unit. Posing a pollution hazard, distilleries in India are now facing closure under environmental laws. But 60 kilometers out of Madras, this large distillery has a different story. For the sugar industry, molasses is a waste product after sugarcane crushing. For alcohol-producing distilleries, it is a basic raw material. From the conversion of molasses into alcohol comes one of the worst industrial effluents, spent wash. Spent wash is a harmful pollutant affecting man and the biosphere. Normally, it is just discharged into rivers. Some distilleries treat the spent wash and get biogas as a byproduct. Here, nearly 10,000 cubic meters of biogas is produced every day and used as a fuel substitute in boilers. This takes care of up to 30% of their energy needs. Even after this treatment, the effluent retains polluting characteristics, for which the further treatment process here is of interest to other distilleries. Bacteria and algae are added to continuously aerated water, which creates an ideal medium for fish breeding. The entire effluent is processed at fish ponds, in which hormonally treated all male fish are bred. The hybrid fish grows in large numbers and even at half the market price, they yield large profits for the distillery. Meanwhile, the fish have cleared the water of color and smell, making it fit to water the sugarcane fields and begin an industrial cycle once again. Extensive research and development has pioneered a zero waste technology at this unit outside Madras. Obviously, the possibilities for combining profits and environment friendly technology exists for all major distilleries in India.